system related error. CH32 error occurs when the discharge temperature of the inverter compressor exceeds 240 degrees Fahrenheit. This error may occur if there is insufficient oil in the compressor or possibly a low refrigerant charge. CH34 error is excessive rise of high pressure. CH34 is an error that usually occurs in between seasons and it occurs when one room is calling for heating when all the others are calling for cooling. CH34 may also be caused by clogged indoor air filters. CH35 error is an error that occurs when the refrigerant pressure is very low or when the low pressure sensor is defective. Compare manifold gauge pressure and LGMV data. And if there is a problem with the refrigerant pressure, inspect the outdoor unit for refrigerant leaks. If the refrigerant level is low during heating operation, a CH-151 error may occur. Next, check for refrigerant leaks in the refrigerant piping between the indoor unit and outdoor unit. If there are no leaks in the refrigerant piping, check the indoor unit for leaks. Be sure to check the field flare connections for leaks. After checking indoor unit, check outdoor unit heat exchanger status or fan operation. After inspecting the outdoor heat exchanger and fan operation, Check whether the LGMV data is normal. A CH24 error indicates the high pressure switch is opened. First, check the power. Next, Check the high pressure switch resistance, and if the measured resistance is 0.1 to 0.6 ohms, the switch is functioning normally. Be sure to check the area around the outdoor unit to ensure that there are no environmental factors such as dirty coils, obstructed fans, etc. Next, check the manifold gauge pressure to compare pressure against the LGMV data. Check if pressure actually rises above the high pressure setting of 580 PSIG. If the pressure exceeds 580 PSIG, the fan operation is normal and the coils are clean. The refrigerant charge should be reviewed for overcharge or non-condensables.